Top 10 Cheapest Countries in Africa Hello Displorers, welcome back to another informative video and thanks for watching. In today's video, we shall be counting down the top 10 cheapest countries to live in Africa. Africa is a continent made up of 54 sovereign countries, with each of these countries providing their unique experiences. The cost of living in most African countries is relatively cheaper compared to that of most countries in Europe and the Americas. Despite the fact that Africa is relatively cheaper to live in, it however has some very expensive cities that can compete with cities such as New York and Paris. For a country to be considered cheap, its basic goods and services need to be affordable for the average citizen of the country. Generally, countries with high per capita income are usually very expensive to live in for obvious reasons while the reverse is true for countries with low per capita income. Most African countries are very affordable to live in but others are more affordable than others. In this video, we shall focus on prices of basic commodities and services that are vital for human existence. If you are new here, welcome, be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our daily uploads. Despite the fact that the countries on this list are relatively cheaper than others, if you are an extravagant person, you might still experience a high cost of living. In this ranking, we are looking at the average cost of living for an average income earner. So in no particular order, here are the top 10 cheapest countries in Africa. Number 10. Rwanda Officially the Republic of Rwanda, Rwanda is a country in the central eastern part of Africa and one of the smallest countries on the African mainland. It has a population of about 12.2 million people and a surface area of about 26.338 km square. The cost of living in Rwanda is relatively cheaper than most of its neighbors. Basic commodities in Rwanda are quite cheap, for example, a liter of milk can go for 733 Rwanda franc, which is less than a dollar. A kilogram of rice on an average can go for 900 Rwandan franc, again less than a dollar. Other basic commodities such as meat, fish, bottled water, fruits, wine, and beer might come as less than $3 per kilogram. When it comes to accommodation, a two-bedroom apartment in the city can go for 450,000 Rwandan franc, which is about $470 and further away from the city, it can go down to $250. Food is also cheap in Rwanda. A decent meal in a decent but not fancy restaurant can cost less than $4. Sporting activities like gym can go for $35 per person per month. When it comes to transportation, a monthly pass for public transport can go for about $15, while a 1 km distance with a taxi can go for less than a dollar. Looking for an African country with a low cost of living, Rwanda should be on your list. Number 9. Nigeria Nigeria is a country in equatorial West Africa and the continent's most populous nation. Though at times very dangerous, Nigeria in general is one of the better places to be an expat in Africa, only behind Kenya or South Africa. Your expenses here will be determined by how extravagant or thrifty you choose to be. This is especially true if you're a fan of imported products or shopping predominantly in grocery shops, supermarkets, etc. In Nigeria, you can get a meal like pressed chicken, suya, pepper soup from a street vendor or local restaurant for 2 to $5. Of course, an expensive date at a fancy restaurant might amount up to $50 for two people, including drinks. Keep in mind that due to the current recession, imported privileges that are sold at bars or the usual hangout spots have doubled and in some entrances tripled prices. Utilities aren't expensive in Nigeria. If you live in a larger apartment, about 85 meters square, all basic utilities like electricity, cooling, water, gas and garbage services will cost you around $26. You may experience occasional water or electric shortages though usually apartments for rent almost certainly include generators. Shopping for clothes is ridiculously cheap in Nigeria, especially if you are an expert coming from the western countries. Quality jeans like Levis will cost you even less than $20. Quality running shoes of brands like Nike cost around $50 while simpler pieces of clothing for summer like short dresses and shirts cost around $25. It's not often that shirts cost more than jeans. Enjoying sports and fitness is always reserved for those who have some money to spare on these activities. And that's why they are always a bit more expensive. A membership at a gym or a fitness club in Nigeria is approximately around $34. Going to the cinema isn't too expensive, but with the low salaries in Nigeria, it isn't cheap either, around $6. Number 8. Kenya Kenya ranks as the 8th cheapest country in Africa according to GoBankingGreats.com. 
Cost of living in Kenya is 50% cheaper than in the United States of America. Housing takes the larger chunk of money from income earners in Kenya, though it is still very cheap. A one-bedroom apartment in the city center can go for 32,000 Kenyan shillings, which is about $317. Out of the city center can go for half the price. Food is also cheap in Kenya. Grocery shopping in a local market is way cheaper than in supermarkets and shopping malls. Items such as meat, eggs can go for less than $2 per kilogram. Fruit and veggies are go for less than a dollar per kilogram. With regards to transportation, a monthly pass in a public transport can go for 3,000 Kenyan shillings, which is about $29, and can be less than a dollar for a 2 km distance. Again, you can also negotiate prices for everything you want to buy in Kenya and get it at a cheaper price. Number 7. Uganda If you are looking for a really cheap country to relocate to, then Uganda is the ideal country for you. The cost of living in Uganda is extremely cheap. Basic commodities such as milk, flour, eggs, meat, fish and fruit are really cheap and can go for less than $3 depending where you are buying from. A one-bedroom apartment in the city center in Uganda can go for about $200 and out of the city can go for less. A two-bedroom can go for $350 per month. Shopping for clothes is ridiculously cheap in Uganda, especially if you are an expert coming from the western countries. Quality jeans like Levis will cost you even less than $15. Quality running shoes of brands like Nike cost around $35, while simpler pieces of clothing for summer like short dresses and shirts cost around $20. It's not often that shares cost more than jeans. With regards to transportation, a monthly pass in a public transport can go for 80,000 Ugandan shillings, which is about $20 and can be less than a dollar for a 3 km distance. Education in Uganda might be a little expensive if you decide to enroll your child in an international school, but if you decide to enroll your child in a public school, it can be way cheaper. Ugandans are very friendly people and overall, you don't have to break a bank to be able to live in Uganda. Number 6. Morocco Morocco is quickly becoming a popular backpacking destination. Its popularity comes from its close proximity to Europe and low-budget flights reaching this country every day. It's also a very safe destination. The cost of living in this North African country is cheap. When it comes to accommodation, a two-bedroom apartment in the city center can go for 3,000 Moroccan dirham which is about $400 and further away from the city it can go down to $250. Food is also cheap in Morocco. A decent meal in a decent but not fancy restaurant can go less than $4. Sporting activities like gym can go for $20 per person per month. When it comes to transportation, a monthly pass for public transport can go for about $15 while a 1 km distance with a taxi can go for less than a dollar. Morocco is currently ranked amongst the cheapest countries in Africa when it comes to cost of living. Number 5. South Africa It is no doubt that South Africa is one of the most developed and most beautiful countries in Africa. But surprisingly, it is also one of the cheapest when it comes to cost of living. Which is very strange because you would expect such a country with a high influx of foreigners to be expensive. In South Africa, if you want to live on a budget, you can do that. And if you decide to live on the high side, you can do that as well. Overall, it is cheap to live there. Food items such as rice, pasta, egg, milk, flour and bread can go for less than $2 per kilogram. Meat and fish can go for about $5 per kilogram. A three-course meal for two in a good restaurant can go for 500 rands, which is about $33. Beer and wine is also cheap in South Africa. Housing is a major problem for most people in South Africa, as it is little expensive compared to its neighboring countries. Though there are some goods and services that are expensive in South Africa, Overall, the country is relatively a cheaper country. Number 4. Algeria Algeria is a very cheap country to work and live in. Basic commodities such as milk, flour, eggs, meat, fish and fruit are really cheap and can go for less than $3 depending where you are buying from. A one-bedroom apartment in the city centre in Algeria can go for about $220 and out of the city can go for less. A two-bedroom apartment can go for $350 per month. Shopping for clothes is ridiculously cheap in Algeria, especially if you are an expert coming from the western countries. Food is also cheap in Algeria. A decent meal in a decent but not fancy restaurant can go for less than $2. Sporting activities like gym can go for $20 per person per month. When it comes to transportation, a monthly pass for public transport can go for about $10, while a 4 km distance with a taxi can go for less than a dollar. 
looking for an African country with low cost of living, Algeria should be on your list because the country has a low cost of living. Number 3. Egypt Egypt is one of the most beautiful and developed countries in North Africa. It is also one of the richest in terms of per capita with a per capita income of about 14,000 US dollars. The cost of living in this North African country is cheap. When it comes to accommodation, a two-bedroom apartment in the city center can go for 2,800 Egyptian pounds, which is about 175 US dollars, and further away from the city, it can go down to 120 dollars. Food is also cheap in Egypt. A decent meal in a decent but not fancy restaurant can go for less than $4. Sporting activities like gym can go for $17 per person per month. When it comes to transportation, a monthly bus for public transport can go for about $10, while a 5km distance with a taxi can go for less than a dollar. Egypt is currently ranked among the cheapest countries in Africa when it comes to cost of living. Number 2. Zambia Officially, the Republic of Zambia is a landlocked country in southern Central Africa. Its neighbors are the Democratic Republic of the Congo to the north, Tanzania to the northeast, Malawi to the east, Mozambique to the southeast, Zimbabwe and Botswana to the south, Namibia to the southwest and Angola to the west. The capital city is Lusaka, located in the south central part of Zambia. The population is concentrated mainly around Lusaka in the south and the Copper Belt province to the northwest, the core economic hubs of the country. Zambia currently ranks second on our list of the cheapest countries to live in. Food and drinks are cheap in Zambia, in fact it is the cheapest compared to most countries in Southern Africa. For a country where a plate of food in a decent restaurant can go for 30 Zambian kwacha, which is about $2, you will understand that such country has very low cost of living. Move to Zambia and start a new life if you intend saving money. Number 1. Tunisia Tunisia is hands down the cheapest country in Africa. Located in the northern region of Africa, the country has a population of about 11.5 million people. Overall, it is cheap to live there. Food items such as rice, pasta, egg, milk, flour and bread can go for less than $1 per kilogram. Meat and fish can go for about $5 per kilogram. A three-course meal for two in a good restaurant can go for 40 Tunisian dinner, which is about $15. Beer and wine are also cheap in Tunisia. Though there are some goods and services that are expensive in Tunisia, overall the country is the cheapest country in Africa to live and work in. There you have it, explorers. Those were the top 10 cheapest countries in Africa. Thanks for watching this video. If you did enjoy this video, do well to give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe and share with your friends.